What's going on YouTube? This your boy DIY Kari coming back to y'all with another video, y'all. Welcome to the channel if you're new and if you already been here, keep liking, commenting, and subscribing to the channel and hit that bell notification. Make sure y'all stay in tune with your boy because I do drop these videos at least three times a week. It's a little slow right now, but if you watched my last video, I said I'm going to run it back with the shoes that I already reviewed to show y'all how they are holding up because I don't see it much. I haven't really seen nobody that run it back. So I'm gonna start doing that for y'all. So stay tuned for those. But into the video that we are doing today, it is on another shoe that is releasing next month, I believe on August 3rd or 4th. It was supposed to release this month, but it got pushed back. So it is what it is, but we still got it early for y'all. From my good people over at pancake.ru so shout out to them for sending these out in such a quick fashion this is the second time your boys working with them and if y'all seen the first one y'all know they did not disappoint their shoes are on point no flaws no nothing so y'all gonna check out these with me and see if it's the same result in the product but before we get into it, this is an information video. I am merely teaching myself still and y'all at the same time about these UAs, Rex, and that other word we don't mention on the channel. So without further ado, let's hop straight into it. I'm gonna show y'all the box first. I'm gonna start out different today. Right off the bat, here is the box. And y'all see, you got the fireworks in the back behind that Jordan logo. These are going to be the Olympic Paris Retro 6s, y'all. I'm so happy to actually get these in hand because I sold my pair from 2012 and I didn't get the pair from 2000. So to have these in hand, it's a little nostalgia because like I said, I had a pair in 2012 when it was the Sydney Olympics, I believe Sydney, 12 years ago. So it's been a while. And every pair that I did try to get, it was just too far gone. So it's gonna be the paper, which has the same design on it with the fireworks, all the nostalgia. This is my size, size 10. They do fit true to size. And just to give y'all the colorway, it is white, varsity, red. But these are the shoes. What a time to be alive. Y'all remember the 2012 version? This is pretty close to it. I can't remember exactly how they look but i will have a picture right here just to show y'all but this is the 2024 version of that one 12 years since they were released now they're back for the paris olympics this one has tumbled leather so y'all can see that leather tumble toe box does bounce back with that tumble leather also has a neoprene feel right here same thing right here and it does have wait does move that does pop off for the lace has the lace locks has the two holes to pull the tongue up and it has your Jordan right there and in case y'all didn't know, that is modeling the Ferrari wing. Super tough shoe, man. Again, Pancake did it again with a clean pair of retro sixes. It's gonna be the other shoe. Just to check for consistency. That's the bottom, which I didn't point out on the other shoe. You got the red Jordan. 
blue going down the middle and the ice on the outsole, the outskirts of the outsole. Red, white, and blue made especially for the Olympics. Jordan at the back. Let me know what y'all think about these in the comments. Like I said, this is nostalgia for me at least. It does have both the bubbles on the outside. Clean shoe, super clean shoe. And to let y'all know, no smell, no glue lines. Only thing that I did notice, which is very small, it had a little paint blotch right there, but I could point out 10 shoes that I bought that had worse than that. So that little thing with the paint running is not a big deal to me. It's not gonna make me not get the shoes. Like I said, I could point out 10 different pair that I bought from the store that has been worse. But this is gonna be an insole. Has that fabric, has a Jordan at the bottom. Super, super clean shoe from Pancake. Let me know what y'all think about these in the comments. Will y'all be waiting till the release or try to get them early with that discount code that is below? And you know me, I don't pay retail or resale. I don't have to. So take advantage of that code that is in the description. If y'all want to check out their website, it is in the description also. Anything else you need will be in the description below. But hit me up with any questions. Hit me up if y'all need any more insight on these shoes or their website or the company in general. I'm here to help. And like I said, I'm still teaching myself. So keep that in mind. But this is your boy DIY Kari signing out. Peace.